how to use WeTransfer to send files. Hello guys, if you are wondering how, here's how you do it. So let's get started without any delay. First of all, you can just go ahead and open up the WeTransfer application. Just go ahead and tap on it in order to open it up. Now, once you open it up, you should be finding this particular interface so once you are logged in. And in order to send files or transfer it, it is very easy. So from this interface right here, you can easily find an option of plus. So just go ahead and tap on it. And once tapped on plus, you can use this option in order to transfer the file. So we have this option of uh, using a link or we have this option of send as email. So let's head over to send as email. It is more convenient. So tap on it. Now, all you gotta do is upload your files and enter up the email address of the recipient and title message and add a password if you prefer and tap on transfer. So first of all, tap on upload files, tap on it, the plus icon, and it gives us option like what kind of files. So you can go ahead and click a picture, scan document or a photo or video library or even browse. Just go ahead and select up a document by using these options available. For example, I have used uh, this uh, file right here, selected this file right here. So you can just go ahead and enter up the recipient name once the file is added in this email section, tap on it and type in the recipient name. So for example, just go ahead and type in the name and confirm it. And you can just go ahead and add up a title. You can add more than one email as well. So you can send up a message like, hi, something like that. You can just go ahead and type in message and uh, once that is done you can add in a password if you prefer and we have the expedition of format as well like date and how much days the file will be expired so once it is selected you can just go ahead and tap on transfer from your screen you can find this option right here tap on it confirm it and it will start preparing to send the file so you just need to wait for a while for the file to be uploaded and it will finalize it and be uploaded to the particular email address that you're trying to send. So this is it. You are done after that. Tap on done and that's it. You can follow this method in order to follow send files using WeTransfer. So I hope this video was helpful. Give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more tips and tutorials.